Chart of the week. A graying government. Oscar Wilde said, with age comes wisdom. That's true. Also true. At a certain point, that stops being true. At around 65 years of age, cognitive decline starts to impede your ability to make rational decisions. So it's concerning that nearly a quarter of United States Congress members are more than 70 years old. This is a new phenomenon. Throughout the 1800s, fewer than 5% of Congress members were older than 70. By the mid-20th century, that number was closer to 10%. It wasn't until the 2000s that we entered a golden era of geriatric rule. Today, half the country is 38 or younger, but only 5% of Congress represents that demographic. And yes, kids can't be in Congress, but you get the point. Meanwhile, we have more members of Congress above 70 years of age than ever before. It's time we started talking about term limits and put more faith in the cohort that will have to live with the policies we create. Young people. Am I an ageist? Yes. Who else is ageist? Biology.